Hey guys, good morning. We are out and about, not able to cruise this time of year because of the pandemic. So we figured that we would give you guys a little food review. Um, we went to a local food truck called Bacon Nation today here in Eugene, Oregon, and um, ordered our food already and we're parked and ready to eat it. So um, let's see what this food looks like. We ordered, um, I got nachos, barbecue nachos. Um, with guacamole. It normally comes with sour cream, but I didn't want sour cream on it. And we will sample these and see how they taste. Okay. Um, we also order what kind of what are these? Uh, bacon cheddar hush puppies. Bacon cheddar hush puppies with some um, like some kind of mustard. Sauce. Yeah, like a little mustard dip or whatever. And then this is I forgot what this is called. A barbecue chicken sandwich with, of course, bacon on it. Um, it looks really good. And well, it's got a blood orange. Oh, yeah, it does have blood orange. Looks like a couple pieces of fruit in there. But we will dig into this and see how it tastes. You want our honest review. So, let's do this. Mm, wow. Look at that. They sure don't skimp on the fillings, that's for sure. And it's pork for it. Right. Hot. Nice and hot. Mm-hmm. That's pretty good. Mm. Really good. I mean, you can taste the ham, pulled pork. You can tell it's been cooked real slow. With that Swiss cheese on it. Mm-hmm. One more. So that sandwich right there, how many stars? Out of 10 stars, how many stars would you get that? It got 10 stars. It's as advertised. It's bacon forward. fresh and it's actually really good I mean you can tell it was a lot of love put into this okay so let's try the hush puppies everybody loves a good hush puppy I wonder what that um sauce is I don't know let's try it out I'll try it and I'll let you try it okay Let's take a, a little bite. Some kind of mustardy, maybe horseradish. A little spice to it. A little kick to it, but it's good. I mean, in the name. Those hush puppies are good. They're nice and crispy. On the outside, mm -hmm. fluffy on the inside like they're supposed to be. You can tell they have like a um, like a smoky flavor to them. They're actually really good. Maybe like a, they kind of give me the sense of like macaroni and cheese. Mm, one of my <coughs> macaroni and cheese bites. Yeah. It's actually pretty good. Yep. All right, so now we are We're to eat to the nacho. going to eat some nachos. The nachos, if you can see, I don't like they loaded them with toppings and bacon, but the chips even have like a little seasoning on them. It makes me almost not want to eat them. They look so good. I don't even know where to start. Looks like there's cilantro, green onions, jalapenos. Cheers. So let's see. Mm. Still got the crunch factor. It does. Mm -hmm. These are really good and you can taste the bacon a lot. That's what I'm saying. They ask ad advertise because when you have a name like Bacon Nation, you know, you got to scream bacon. And so far, mm -hmm. the first two dishes scream bacon. Which everybody knows food trucks are, they have good food anyways. But there's like, um, there's a lot of food trucks around here. A lot. Yeah, that we just need to get more into. You want to taste it? Sure. 
it's really good i give bacon nation 10 stars um they were really nice the the staff is really friendly their menu was good it had they had a pretty good menu and we'll insert some pictures of their food truck and um some their pictures menu. of their menu um into our video but if you're ever in the eugene area and you want good um food we definitely recommend bacon nation so thanks for tuning in to our food truck experience today if you guys um, want to like comment subscribe to our page please do um, and hopefully soon we'll be uploading some more videos yeah um we're gonna try to get some more content on our page um seeing how the, the cruise industry is not like going right now so so we'll turn into <clears throat> the next best thing which is being foodies because that's what we are at heart and so like uh we'll definitely start being more active on our page and taking you guys on a, a food journey with us yep so please just show us some love and um we'll see you guys the next time we stop at a food truck or go eat at a nice restaurant thank you see you guys later